Good morning. Dr. Roger Smalligan joins me. We're talking about something that's being considered an outbreak that is making people sick all across the country. Right. It's something the first case of this was reported in late June. It's called cyclospora and it's it's a parasitic infection that usually we don't think it's not very commonly found and usually you see it in people who've been traveling to Central or South America mm -hmm. could be India could be Asia it's kind of worldwide in developing areas where the sanitation is not that good because mm -hmm. it's spread like any other um, travelers disease and the symptoms will be like other similar travelers diseases like um, where you get some abdominal pain maybe some fever some anorexia um, some fatigue and diarrhea is often a component. You might see it in patients who have a depressed immune system like HIV, but the interesting thing with this outbreak right now is that it's happening in people who have normal immune systems. And when they've done the investigation, the CDC's working on it. They've had 285 cases reported so far in the United States, and that includes Texas. Um, wow. And they're trying to figure out, is there something common? Is there a common mm -hmm. food source? Because that is something that they have seen in the past where it's maybe been uh, fruits or vegetables that haven't been washed well or haven't been, you know, disinfected well. So I think probably the message we want to get out is to just be careful, wash your hands. If it's fresh fruit, fruits and vegetables, wouldn't hurt to, to wash them really well and, um, and just keep an eye out. And if you do notice these symptoms, maybe contact your area's health department. That would be good. Yeah, it's a reportable disease and we want to know about it at the health department. It's called cyclospora uh, or, uh, and it's treatable though with a simple antibiotic that's pretty inexpensive. And what's interesting is you had said that they put out this kind of a warning out in June and it hasn't been that long and already over 200 cases have been reported. Right, so who knows how many are gonna yeah. turn up in the United States, yeah? All right, wash your hands. Okay, right. Thank you, Dr. Right. Small again. Right. Thank you.